In today's video, I'm going to be going over the top five best free stock footage websites. Stock footage is a great way to spice up your content, but there are a lot of sites that require you to pay a monthly fee. But on the other hand, there are a lot of great sites you can use to access tons of different free stock videos that you can use in your YouTube videos for absolutely free. These sites have thousands, if not millions of different videos you can use, and we're going to be going over the top five. Now, I've made sure that all of the sites on this list will also let you download these clips for absolutely free and use them in your YouTube videos for commercial purposes, meaning that you won't run into any any copyright or monetization issues. So with that being said, let's get started. Now these websites aren't ranked in any particular order, but the first one we're going to be talking about is Vidivo. And Vidivo has thousands of stock videos that you can access in both 4K and HD that are uploaded by various videographers. And this is a common theme you're going to notice. A lot of these sites are run publicly by a community of filmmakers and videographers. So there's always going to be new content added to these sites. Now, one thing that makes Vidivo different is that it also has a lot of motion graphics templates. So for example, if you needed a countdown timer, you could find it here. And they also have sound effects so it's a great all-in-one platform. Now, in terms of licensing, most of the free content is under the Vidivo Attribution License or the Creative Commons Attribution 3.0 License. And this means that what you can basically do is you can use these clips in your videos, but you do have to give credit in the description, but you can use it for both personal and commercial uses, which is great. Now, one drawback of Vidivo is that I found that a lot of the clips were premium. So there's not as many free clips that you can access compared to the other options on this list, but we're going to get to those right now. Next up on the list is Pexels. And this is a site that I personally use a lot because there's an extremely large library of stock videos and photos, both available in HD and 4K. It's very much like a social media site because there's lots of challenges for the videographers and photographers, and there's also different people you can follow. And because of this, there's always so much content being added every single day, and it's a really nice community. While Pexels isn't the most organized site, they have a great way to discover new clips. And if there is anything you wanna find, you can easily do it via the search and I can find literally any type of photo or video that I want because the library is so large. Now with the Pexels license, you can use all of their videos and photos in your content. You can also modify it and still use it for both personal and commercial use. And you don't have to credit the original creator as well. Although of course it is always good to do so. The third option on the list is Pixabay. And Pixabay is very similar to Pexels because it is also community run. So there's a ton of content that you can access. Now Pixabay also has thousands of different vectors and some royalty free music that you can also access. I found that Pixabay was also very well organized organized. So it's really easy to sort video clips by different you know, elements, such as the size of the clip, as well as the resolution. And the Pixabay license is also very similar to Pexels. So basically you can use all the content for free and commercial use. You don't have to give credit and you can modify the content in any way that you want. Now, the one difference I found with Pixabay is that they definitely have a greater focus on photos than videos, hence the name. So while they do have over 10,000 free stock videos that you can use, they also have like 1.8 million free photos. So the focus definitely lies in the images, not the videos. But even with that being said, there's over 10,000 video clips. So the library for videos is also fairly large. Next up on the list is Cover. And I'm a really big fan of Cover because they have lots of very unique content. They have a bunch of different categories that you can explore from, as well as lots of very niche footage. And <laughs> it's kind of hard to explain, but when you have sites such as you know pixels or pixabay where the community is uploading footage usually videographers are taking footage of things such as you know the mountains and rain but on cover you can find videos of for example, people doing random tasks that might be helpful for your videos. You know, the kind of content that a normal stock footage studio would be filming. And they also have other unique content such as Zoom virtual backgrounds that you can also access. Now in terms of licensing, it's very similar to the previous sites. So you can use all of their videos for both personal and commercial use. You don't have to ask for permission or give any credit and you're free to modify the content in any way that you please. Now the final website on this list is VidEasy. VidEasy has stock footage that you can access in both HD and 4K, and they have about a thousand stock videos in their library that you can access. Now, what makes VidEasy very different is that they also have a ton of After Effects templates and vectors. So you can also add elements to your videos, such as lower thirds and find templates directly from VidEasy, which is great. And they also have a lot of different video backgrounds. So if you're looking to make an outro as well, you know, you can find the background footage on this site. Now, if you're using VidEasy, one tip I would give is that you use the standard 
standard content filter so you can find all of the free videos because they also have premium content but you have to pay to access it so by using the filters you can only look at the free content other than that i would say vidizi is one of the best organized sites and with the free version all of the content is under the creative commons license which means that you can use the content for both personal and commercial use as long as you give credit to the owners and they have all of the credit information as well so if you go on a certain video clip you can easily see how you can give credit for that clip as well as the specific licensing information but that's about it hopefully you guys did find a stock footage website that you're going to be using in the future and if you did be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and as always thanks for watching my name is iovo and i'm signing out